Hello and welcome to yet another, well in this case first, episode of new series that I call How the hell can Fusion 360 be so slow? Yes, in this episode we will look at selecting. Yes, very simple task, nothing special. In my case you can see what I have here, I have a bunch of bunch of uh, sketch profiles that are made of with with these lines well i don't know how many there is is maybe like 40 by 50 or something of them and even when i move my mouse you can see how how even have hovering effect is being lagged behind and my machine is not you know it's not bad it's it's not latest it's 2008 uh, mac and it has 32 gigabytes of RAM. Yeah, so it's not like, you know, slowest machine ever. And it's not like this task is seems extremely complicated. But yeah, let's see how fast can I select these, how many there, like um, 14 boxes. Okay, so we press shift, we move our mouse and we start waiting. And we wait, and we wait, and our Fusion 360 is hanging because I can't do anything because, well, they don't have anything in UI thread. And here we go. It's been selected. Now, can you imagine how much time was it when I was selecting this whole area? Yeah, that was a lot. That was a lot of time. I mean, like, minutes. I was sitting for, like, five minutes waiting for it to finish selecting. Anyway, let's select these boxes here and we wait and we wait and we wait some more and we wait some more because I have nothing to do right than waiting for it to be selected so I can do what I want I mean you can imagine when I start to extrude those things it will be massively painful but that's for some content for the next episode in this episode we selecting we're selecting those boxes and we still wait, we still wait, you can see we still wait, yep. And we still wait, we wait, we wait those boxes to be selected. And it's done, thank you very much. That would be, that's it for today. Uh, in the next episode, I will get 80. Thank you, bye.